Hi everyone, this is Serena, also known as Shelly, and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be experimenting with the Apray Gel X Nail Extensions. I'll be using those on four of my fingers and on my thumb. I'll be using the McCart Jelly Tips because the Apray Jelly Tips are not wide enough. That's good. Also be using the model ones mini UV lamp and the model one six in one nail glue I'm going to get everything organized and then I'll get started I've already put gel extensions on my left hand and removed the shine from them. First thing I would do is remove the shine from my natural nails on my right hand. I'm going to take the nail glue and apply it to my fingernails instead of on the nail extension to ensure that I have enough glue on my nails. Many people will apply the nail glue to the nail extension. I've tried that method and usually I will have less glue on my fingernails in order to get the gel extension to adhere. Many people make this process look so easy, but basically I just wanna show you from my beginner's perspective. After I cure the nails with the mini nail lamp, I'm going to use my full size nail lamp to cure the nails for one minute. And once my nails are cured, I'm going to use the Manny Boss Dip Powders. Sorry that you couldn't read them, but the names of those dip powders are Pumpkin Kisses and Cozy Up. Cozy Up is a dip powder with glitter and flakes. And Pumpkin Kisses is a solid shimmer color. What I'll be doing next is removing the shine from the extensions so that the dip base can adhere to the fingernails. I'm going to be using the Savaland Dip Liquids and I'm going to start with the Pumpkin Kisses Dip Powder on my thumb, my forefinger, and my pinky and then I'll use Cozy Up on my middle finger and ring finger. Also each time I use the base I always wipe the brush off on a paper towel before I get it, put it back in the bottle. 
so that I don't contaminate my liquids. So while you're watching this process, I just want to share a little bit about me. This is not my only channel on YouTube. I have another channel that I've been active on for the past 10 years, and it is called Loving the Natural Me. I will post the name on the screen. On that channel, I have over 100 videos about life and my dreadlock journey. And if you're interested, you can check them out over there. Also on that channel, I used to do a money, Monday manicure videos when I would polish my nails with nail lacquer. Since then, I got into gel polish last summer and dip powder this past summer. And I decided to start a separate channel called Shelly Loves Locks. I'm sorry, Shelly Loves Nails. And this is where I would like to share manicures on natural nails and experiment like I am today. A little bit more about me personally. I am 47 years old and I have a 27 year old daughter. And I've been married to my husband for almost 10 years and we've been together since 2008. We both are veterans. He served in the United States Navy and I served in the United States Army. We both served in Operation Enduring Freedom and Operation Iraqi Freedom. And we love to tease each other during the Army Navy games. Currently, I work in higher education in a position where I help veterans receive their education benefits. And my husband is a mechanic who runs his own shop. If you have any other questions about me, please comment below. I filed and buffed my nails off camera and now I'm going to be using my top coat by Savaland to finish off my nails. One thing I forgot to do on the, two, on the fingers that I have the glitter flake powder on is to encapsulate it with clear dip powder. Again, that's a beginner mistake. You might watch videos and people do everything so perfect because I've seen videos where everything is done so perfectly, but I'm just showing you from a beginner's perspective how things roll. And this is the finished product. Some of the nails may look crooked. Again, I'm a beginner and I'll finish off with using my OPI cuticle oil. And there you have it. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. If you would like to subscribe, please do so. And I'll see you all in another video. Bye.